Hey guys, Christina Dealer here. Today I'm playing more Star Sable, and today is my mom's birthday, and the Potato Festival. It is my time. It's the Potato Lord. It is my time. I'm going to save all the potatoes from being eaten. I must save them. And yes, I am riding my Star Terry Pirate. I live in Proud Town. What is this? What is this? Howdy, Christina. You're here to take part in the traditional potato planting, just like everyone else, right? It's getting more and more popular every year. Well, there, cowboy, you don't know what I'm talking about. The potato fest planting tradition, tradition is something we do to celebrate. Hate that the frost is finally gone from the ground and that warmer times are on their way. Now we can finally grow things in the ground again. We celebrate by digging out the potatoes from the potato patch that have managed to survive the winter. I don't know how they make it through, though. Through. But there's something special new about the earth here on York. Somehow it makes potatoes super big and able to withstand the cold. Those buds that make it through the winter are incredibly delicious. And are something of a delicacy around these parts. After that, we plant new potatoes in a riding competition where the most local, daring local riders, riders compete. Knowing you, it sounds like something you'd like to have a go at. But for now, right, head out to the potato patch and dig up a huge potato. Then I'll teach you how to bake potato. Make the best baked potato. Get it, Christina. I'm not going to cook my own kind. <laughs> I'm gonna go look for some of my children. Some of my children. Oh, that's a cute. That's Z. I got Z here. And Z just is here. Oh, I want here to watch the potato festival. And my poor potato children. Oh, my poor children. I feel so sorry. Oh. Yay, found a potato. Okay, let's go back. Wow. This time I have Star Sable Lucy again, guys. It's fine. She's fine. Be back. What? What? I went through a bush. And it was like I missed a jump. Wow, because you know, look at the size of that potato. I'm proud of my child. Well, Christina, what a find. This potato is going to be perfect. Now, let's see. This potato needs to be baked. But we need another other ingredients if it's going to be the perfect baked potato. All we're missing now is some silver glade sage and some traditionally turned butter. Make a sm start by grabbing me a bunch of silver glade sage you'll find around the birch tree by the stables. Okay. These are some fine looking herbs. Thanks. Now I just need, to, need some butter and we can make the perfect old country style baked potato. You can fetch the butter, can you? You fetch the butter, you say? Great! Right up to Derek at the Silverglade Aid Post Office. He should have a nice pack of newly churned butter for me. Okay, let's go. Okay, we are here. Oh, it's Lisa. I mean, Anne. And Concord. From Starshine Legacy. <coughs> hey, Christina. Are you here to send something or pick something up? Yeah, I need to send that. Welcome back, Christina. How have you been? Yeah, absolutely. I got a package from Marley. Here you go. Say hey to him from me. Okay, time to head back. Whee! Oh my goodness, I survived that. I thought I would have gotten, I would have took it, taken a quote unquote dangerous fall. Hmm. Oh, this is perfect, Christina. This butter is the best you can get. Oh, you need to get down? Oh no. Carl twin out of the way. Come 
here, Peril Twin. Go. Okay, just quickly change my boots. So, you reckon you're ready to prepare the perfect potato? My family has, has had this tra tradition for generations. And now it's your turn to learn how to do it. You think it's going to be easy, you say? Oh, no. Yawn. Mm, it looks easier than you say it actually is, Christina. Be sure to follow my instructions carefully. And we'll have a potato so tasty that you'll be saying, Thank you, baked potato. Let's go. Oh, my children. Okay. 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 Why isn't anyone disappearing? Okay. Eh. People, move your horses. Put the potato in the oven. Eh. The giant potato. Herbs. Woohoo, Christina, this smells incredibly good. Let me try your baked potato. Om nom 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 nom. She just ate my child. She just ate my child. Yeah, that's one of the best baked potatoes. Oh. That's one of the best baked Oh, that's odd. That was one of the best baked potatoes I've ever eaten. That sure brings me... It brings up memories from when I was just a boy. My old grandma used to make potatoes just like this with me when I was knee high to a grasshopper. Oh my goodness, that's small. Wow, that flavor is exactly the same. These are some good old memories. Okay, gonna get on Pearl Twain again. I don't know what happened, because usually when you do those kinds of things, everyone disappears, but no one disappeared. All right, Christina, now you've learned how to take care of the potatoes that and make it through all the winter. we got uh, left. It's the final step in our traditional potato celebrations. Time to plant the new potatoes. Right over to, over to Elvie, and she'll go through it all with you. You like your writing to be a little wild and crazy, huh? We fancied up some regular potato planting, so that'll be a little more exciting. Be sure to grab the potato right here next to me before you write off. Good luck, Christina. Okay. Okay, right there. Let's go. Don't be shy. Come take part in the festivities. You here for the annual annual potato planting race? Right? Hey there, stranger. My name's Elvie, and I guess I do little bit of everything here at Marty's Farm. I make sure the horses are looked after and that the yard is always clean and tidy. Oh, Emma's there! With the little Molly. The skipper! I want that, that shit to go. I want it! I want that pony. When it comes out, that's the one I'm gonna get. You've been to see Marley, you say? Good! Oh, wait, guys, hang on. There we go, just had to start a new recording. Then you know how well, it's important to us to hold on to our traditions and celebrate the thawing of the frost. We've been waiting all winter for the day to come when we're able to use the soil again. I'm always so delighted every year when it comes when it's time for a potato party. Springtime you really puts a spring in your step. <laughs> We've come up with a new race where we plant potatoes in the ground to celebrate the frost disappearing. I understand that you want to compete against others. But we'll have a little test run first so that you know the rules. The race is basically a run out onto the potato patch where you have to plant as many potatoes as you can on all the indicated spots. Then you just hurry back to me here by the finish line and the first one to do so is the winner. 
There is a whole heap of prestige to be be won by being crowned the winner of this race. Saddle up and ride like the wind. Ooh. This is new. There's a ribbon now. It's like a Yorba thingy. Let's go! Yeah. Boom. 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 And boom. Ow. Boom. Boom. And boom. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Yay. Woohoo, nice riding. You're going to be a tough competitor for the other riders to beat. Go out to the next sport here by he means sign yourself and your friends up for a race. Good luck, Christina. I've got faith in you. Okay. And that's it. This is a cute little ribbon. It's like a little your baggy and thingy, I think. That's cool. Okay, guys, this is the end of the video. I couldn't save my potato children, but at least I was able to make more potato children. Leave a like, subscribe, you comment in, and prance around with me, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!